Hi, this is Julian from Minute Earth. And for now, let me also be frank. We're making this video to ask you to support educational channels like ours, and here's why. There are plenty of fact-based videos on YouTube, like this one we made about how ocean boundaries are mostly human creations. And then there are uh, other less fact-based videos, like these ones, which contain straight up wrong and grossly misleading information about ocean boundaries, and which, unfortunately, millions of people have watched. This makes our little stick figure science communicator hearts hurt a little bit, especially when we see comments correcting carefully researched videos with the blatant misinformation from those other videos. Research shows that people trust YouTube to recommend videos that help them understand the world around them, which is actually, uh, unfortunate, because research also shows that lots of videos on YouTube help you misunderstand the world around you. For example, a recent report shows that over 20% of views on YouTube videos related to climate change were on videos containing false information. Not to mention the more immediate concern of videos making false statements about the ongoing COVID-19 pandemic. Of course, we're not saying all channels posting misinformative videos are part of nefarious disinformation campaigns, although some are. Many misinformative videos are made by well-intentioned people accidentally getting something wrong, or by people who just don't care if their information is right or wrong, as long as they're getting views. YouTube clearly hasn't done enough to stop people from uploading or watching misinformative videos. Thankfully, there are a bunch of channels out there that do provide entertaining yet rigorously fact-checked and substantive videos, but those videos take more time and effort than the slapdash misinformative ones. So, where is all that time and effort spent? Well, we can only speak to our own process, but when writing a video script, we spend hours poring over dozens of academic papers, sometimes just to get a single sentence right. If you're ever curious, check out the list of references in the description of every video, including this one. And then we speak directly with experts in the field to clear up any questions we have and make sure we have a clear understanding of the topic. This is made easier by the fact that many members of our own staff are experts in all sorts of stuff. And then our writers go through many, 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 many rounds of feedback and rewriting within our team to make sure each script is as clear and accurate as possible. And despite our videos being filled with goofy, faceless stick figures and over-anthropomorphized everything, our illustrators also dive deep into the scientific literature themselves to produce visuals that are evocative, cute, and yet still representative of the science. Fact-based, entertaining educational videos demand hard work. And so, as promised, this is the part of the video where we call on you to support channels like us that prioritize facts over clicks. And the best way to support Minute Earth is by laughing at our terrible puns. Okay, no, really, it's by sharing and engaging with our videos. And it would be a huge help if those of you who are able to become patrons at patreon.com slash Minute Earth. Because Patreon support lessens our reliance on ad-based revenue sources, which have become way less reliable in these times of global pandemic, and enables us to keep making educational videos about the most interesting science stories on the planet. And if the sweet, sweet comfort of knowing you're helping spread wholesome, accurate science videos isn't enough, if you join us on Patreon, you'll also get access to exclusive content like beautiful illustrations that didn't make it into a video, the ability to participate in fun community activities like our recently launched caption contest, and you'll get to watch every video early and leave comments that confuse future viewers into thinking you're a time traveler. Whether you're a patron or not, from the bottom of our little stick figure science communicator hearts, thanks for supporting us so we can channel our energy into this channel.